Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Bloodborne. This place is a nightmare. <laughs> oh, I kill myself. I literally do kill myself by falling off again and again and again and again on this dumb elevator ride. Because I just, I don't, I don't know how walking off elevators works. I keep trying to do it too high, I think. I don't know. We're here, though. All right. Brain Town. These things are the worst enemy in any video game ever. And now, apparently, if they see you, like, if they can open their big central eye in the front of their face, they do that. You get, uh, the laser sticks shot at you. The frenzy sticks. Oh my gosh. Damn it. I tried to dodge. Just didn't work. No doge for me. This is gonna hurt. This is probably gonna kill me. <laughs> okay, so... What did I learn? I think I learned how to walk off the elevator. Wait till it's way lower than I feel comfortable walking off. And then do it. Um, I also learned that maybe the sword is not very effective against those monstrosities. At least not in its tiny sword form. So... We'll go give this a bash and see if it works. Also, I flippin' hate this damn place. I don't like the brain monsters. I didn't like the one that I encountered in the nightmare. Uh, over in the nightmare frontier. And I don't like these ones. I think I like these ones even less, because they shoot the, like, frenzy spear things at you. Oh. So many uh, horrible horrible enemies in this game. I think Bloodborne has some of my most despised enemies in video games ever. All right. Two for two on the elevator in this video. Also, sedatives are expensive as balls. So I can't afford to just, like, keep wasting them. Okay, we learned a thing. Please don't fill all the way, please don't fill all the way, please don't fill all the way. It just barely stopped short of filling all the way. So I learned a thing. Uh, this sword, like long sword form, great sword, whatever you want to call it, super duper baller for fighting those dumb brains. I can stagger them out of their grab animation. Oh, that's very good to know. Now, this part scares me quite a bit. Good. Frenzy, please stop climbing. Frenzy, please stop climbing. Frenzy, please stop climbing. She's singing. Which is worse, the singing or the creepy tentacle noises? Because the singing is so... dissonant with what these things are. Also, good grief, Frenzy goes down way too slow. I think the plan here is just like, Charge in, full on charge, attack. Ooh, or not, or we can sneak. You could call me Solid Snake. Look at this. Come 
More cursed gems. So they just drop cursed droplet gems all the time, don't they? That's maybe not a cursed one? It was on that corpse? That's cool. All right, what's our prize for making it this far? Flipping spiders. Because why wouldn't it be, right? These are spiders with people's faces on them. And they scream when they die. Okay, so now we know that our nightmare spider friend is not just a complete fluke. He's one of these things. God, those are atrocious. So what? Why? Ooh, is this that shortcut lever? I kinda wanna fall down the hole. I think I mostly don't. This is a different lever. Oh, cutscene. <laughs> what? Did I just kill a thing that we'd never even encountered? I'm kind of okay with that. I don't think those were spider people. I think they were just spiders. Oh, god damn it. Another one of those freaking brains. Thanks, game, for combining the worst enemies ever in the same area. Oh, are you kidding me? I have to dash across one of those? One's wisdom. Arcane damp blood gem. More great one's wisdom. Okay, I'm sensing a pattern here. That might be our ticket back up.
I am going to go back and fight that brain thing in a moment. If this is a shortcut, though, this will make life a hell of a lot easier. Please. Oh. <sighs> of course it's locked. So this is where that thing was. That, was, that shape on the screen creeped me out. So this must, I mean, not must, but this is quite possibly what was like shooting the frenzy laser things at us. There's an item there. I kind of want that. Oh, that seems like a one-way trip, though. Okay, I'm going to go try to deal with the brain. Try being the operative word there. Oh, I do not feel good about this. Okay. And I didn't get frenzied. Booyah. Choir bell. Invigorates all cooperating parties, healing them. Seven quicksilver bullets. Holy moly. Special hunter tool of the choir. High ranking members of the church. Fashioned after a bell that projects an arcane sound across planes of existence. The sound of this smaller, silver version of the bell does not cross planes, but grants vigor and healing to all cooperators. That's actually really, really neat. Although weird that they give it to you so late in the game here. Are we... Down there? Oh, that might have been the spider room. Oh. I wonder if all those spiders were one time only enemies. I don't really care either way. I never want to deal with them ever again. And I never want to go back into that room to find out. That was just an odd situation. Okay, now this is a thing that we did. Eyes flipping everywhere. Ooh. Oh. A large, solid chunk that forms in cold blood. After death, a substance, blah, 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 blah. This is no mere chunk. It is nearly a boulder. Few bloodstones of such size have ever been discovered, even considering the combined experience of all the hunters. Yes. Oh, yes. I don't know which way I want to go. So we're just going to go this way. This way did not have an enemy guarding it. That is literally my reasoning. Okay. Spiders do respawn. Huh. So we're back here. This is weird. Do I want to fight through all this again? I really don't. Fifty-one thousand blood echoes. Do we have any idea how much I need to level up? We probably have enough.
Let's take a look at those blood gems and see if any of them are worthwhile. Oh my gosh, we have so many of these things. Cursed Tempering Damp. HP gradually depletes. Minus eight. No. Attack versus beasts down. No. Arcane attack up. That's actually kind of cool. We could legit blah, blah, blah. We could legitimately make an actual arcane weapon now. We have a couple of these. I'm not going to, but we could. Blood attack up. That actually seems really good on like a pistol. And then just physical attack up plus 18. That's a that is a large number. That one might be worth slotting into something. Let's uh I can't see how much I need to level up, can I? I'm going for it. The blood gem is what pushed me over the edge. And you know what? I'm just going to sell off the cursed ones. I don't want them. They're just cluttering up my inventory. This one is maybe usable. This one, definitely not ever. Yeah, same with you. Not very worthwhile. Arcane attack will hold on to you. Blood attack will hold on to you. And physical attack will hold on to you. So we should most definitely have enough to level up once oh, now. Flora. Oh, little ones. Let the hunter be safe and let this dream, her captor, foretell a pleasant awakening be one day a fond, distant memory. I do kind of like that little poem that she says. I forgot about that. Ah, welcome home, good hunter. I must... What is it? So she's praying to Flora? Very well. Let me... I mean, we've heard that before, but... Oh my gosh, I'm a thousand short. Farewell, good hunter. You have got to be kidding me. <laughs> Welcome... Very well. Yeah, we're gonna go with the stamina. Farewell. I'm fairly comfortable with where my HP's at right now. Fortify! Oh, still just barely not enough. So this might be the one we want to replace with the droplet. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yep. That's great. Plus one. That's fine. You're fine there. And then the hunter pistol. Yeah. Again, I don't really use the pistol for damage, but no harm in upping that damage a little bit. And I'm going to use my blood rock. Just need to sell some more crap off first. Runes don't sell for much. <laughs> That's more than enough. I just kind of got caught up selling too many things there. Okay. Uh, fortify. Ba bam. Level 10. Weapon Master. Yeah. Damn straight. 
488 for Ludwig's and then 454 for the Tonitrus. But the Tonitrus gets uh, gets one of these. Bam! Jumping up to 700 damage. Oh, that's great. Cool. Let's go kick this place's butt. Nightmare of Menses. I also want to run around and, like, visit some of our NPC friends again before I end the game. So I don't know when the game is going to end. I'm assuming there's going to be some sort of epic, like, huzzah, now you can go and face Lord Gwyn in the kiln of the first flame. Like, I, I think there's going to be some sort of identifiable moment. Absolutely nothing to base that on. I mean, for all I know, we could get to the top, fight a boss, and then the credits could start rolling. Doesn't seem like the game would do that, but it's entirely possible. Um, but yeah, I do just kind of want to go check up on everybody, see how they're doing. Yeah, we're going to roll with the Tonatrus here against the Shadows of Yarnum. Get away from the flamethrower one, because he can murder me. I don't think he can here in his non-boss form, but... He still hits hard. I don't like those enemies. They're actually, like, the least threatening thing that we've encountered in here. Oh, hello, there's the third shadow. Uh-huh. I knew there were three. I didn't know that... I mean, there were three, like, when we fought the boss. I didn't know that all three were going to be here. That's kind of weird. <sighs> Anything back here? No. So we got up and we got other up and we got down. More chunks. Chunks are awesome. I don't really have anything else I want to upgrade, though. I'm pretty settled on my weapons here. I dig my weapon choice. So what is snorting? And why do we keep... Okay. It is exactly what was snorting. And I should just be able to sneak up on you and get a visceral hit. That would be awesome. Yep. Nope. Oh my gosh, it had eyes. That thing had way too many eyes. Oh, the game is taking our familiar enemies and just twisting them and making them horrible. Which is fantastic. But in like a really disturbing sort of way. Okay, so they're still down. We still need to explore down. And another pig. With... Oh, two pigs. Nope. Holy moly. Eyeball pigs do a lot of damage. I was expecting it to hurt, and I was kind of expecting to live. Oh, 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 oh. gross. Two down. I know that there's the third one here. I don't actually need him to walk off the ledge. We can just come up here and deal with him. This guy's a pushover. 
Goodbye. Literally, I pushed him over the edge. Oh. Aren't I hilarious? Okay, pig's gonna have my souls. Let's not deal with pigs just yet, then. Well, that was an abrupt end. So that's the way out. So that must be like a... A drop... Yeah, I want to drop onto that. Okay, we'll uh, maybe do that in a moment. Let's kill this pig, at least. Oh, nice, and my blood echoes are just right there in front of him. There we go. Punched him right in the butt. Just got my fist right up in there. Okay, not gonna deal with the other ones just yet. Yeah, this is where I wanna go. What a weird, like, design for an area. Although I know this is a nightmare realm, so. That's kind of meaningless. Yeah, three chunks. Oh, so many chunks. So much blood. So many chunks. Okay. Another shadow of Yarnum. Got it. I hear your friend behind me. This is bad. Okay, I killed you. You don't have stretchy snake arms. That's great. Oh, I just went Indiana Jones on that guy. Yeah. So where's the third one? The fire breather. Also, damn pigs. Stomping around up there. Oh my gosh, there's a whole truckload of them. I can deal with a couple at a time. You guys are way easier than your boss forms were. By a long shot. Very nice. Okay. Eyeball pigs. So this is where you patrol to. Can I just fight one of you, please? I can fight one of you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. This way. Come on, eyeball pig. Come on, please. I'm right here. I know you can see me. You can see me like eight freaking times. Yeah, the other one's coming. That's what I'm worried about. Holy crap. Get me away from these guys. Whew. 
that was scary. All because I had to run away from the other pig. Now, I think these are just the two that are patrolling. So I'm really hoping there aren't any more eyeball pigs. No eye pigs, please. Not allowed. things are creepy with their eyeballs. Why does everything have eyes? Why is everybody obsessed with eyes? What happened in Bergenworth? Nourishing damp blood gem. Okay. Yep. So this is all that area. Sweet. Nice. Going down was a very, very good choice. 68,000 blood echoes. Jeez, we have enough to level up again. And I'm feeling like we should be finding a shortcut soon, hopefully. I'm really, really hoping for a shortcut. We're approaching... Hello. I have fought these things in dungeons. I do not like. Oh no, it's you! You were down there when I killed Rom the Vacuous Spider. You made the moon get all creepy. Who the hell are you and why are you bloody in your midsection where your child was probably ripped out? What? You're wearing a wedding dress. Part of me wants to attack her. I'm not going to. I was totally expecting her to be one of those evil teleporting ghosts. Okay. Shortcut? I was expecting you... Yeah, no, down actually is correct. Yeah, okay, back to the shortcut hub. Sweet. Awesome. That is exactly where I was expecting to connect up. Cool. Alright, don't know why you're here crying. You got the ruffled thing on your neck. Yeah, I don't know what your story is. You're crying about this place, though. Yeah, we're going up next time. Not now. Ha ha! Cliffhanger! Ha 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 ha! How do you like me now?